بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم اینڈ اے ویری گڈ ایوننگ ٹو آل آف یو آئی ایم امجد علی ہیئر فرام دوہا قطر ٹوڈے آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو شیئر ود یو میجر ایکسپیریمنٹ نمبر تھری سم امپورٹنٹ کوشچنس اینڈ آنسرس اباؤٹ دس ایکسپیریمنٹ اٹ از دا لسٹ آئی آلریڈی شیئر ود یو دس لسٹ میجر پریکٹیکلس نائن مارکس کوشچن ول کم فرام ہیئر ایکسپیریمنٹ نمبر ون آئی آلریڈی شیئر ود یو نو ٹوڈے آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو شیئر ود یو ایکسپیریمنٹ نمبر تھری ایکسپیریمنٹ نمبر تھری از اے اسٹینڈرائز دا گیون سولوشن آف کے ایم ایل او فور اینڈ کیلکولیٹ دا والیوم آف کے ایم ایل او فور ریکوائرڈ فار پریپیرنگ ون ڈی ایم کیو آف زیرو پوائنٹ KMNO4 solution volumetrically. Equipment required for this experiment is burette, iron stand, beakers, pipet, funnel, conical flask, weighing balance. Chemicals 0.1 molar FeSO4 0.2 molar KMNO4, dilute hydrochloric acid and distal water. Here the standard solution will be 0.1 molar FeSO4, indicator KMNO4 itself act as indicator and point will be again light pink. Important, you must memorize this equation 2 KMNO4 react with 8 H2SO4 plus 10 FeSO4.7 H2O. After reacting, the product is K2SO4, MnSO4 and 5 FeSO4 thrice plus 78 H2O. Procedure Procedure of this experiment is different from acid based titration. Here you take KMNO4 mixture solution in the burette, then 10 cm cube of standard FeSO4 solution in a titration flask with the help of pipette, then add half test tube of dilute sulfuric acid, titrate it against KMNO4 mixture solution from the burette. Note the buret reading when color changes to light pink. Take three readings. Observation and calculation. Observation and calculation you will proceed same like that acid base titration. You will take three readings and draw a table like this one. Initial reading you can start from zero and then for example 10 cm cube of KMNO4 is used, so your final reading is 10. Then you can continue from that 10 and suppose more volume used till 20, so again your reading is 10 cm cube. So in this way you can take the three readings. These are suppose reading, for example it is 10. You can calculate the mean volume of KMNO4 used by adding these three value and divide with three. So you can get the mean value. Here all are 10. So your mean volume is 10 centimeter cube. Now you can calculate the molarity of KMNO4 by using this simple formula M1V1 over N1 is equal to M2V2 over N2. Here N1 and N2, it will come from balanced chemical equation. You will put the all value and you can find the molarity. Molarity of KMNO4 is 0.02 molar. So molarity of given solution KMNO4 was 0.02 molar. So now use the formula given and required. Any M1V1 is equal to M2V2. With the help of this formula, you can calculate the volume which you will take from 0.02 molar 
and then dilute it. So V1 is equal 0 0.01 into 1000 centimeter cube divided 0 0.02 molar. Answer is 500 centimeter cube. It means you will take 500 centimeter cube of 0 0.02 molar K mono 4 solution and dilute it to 1000 centimeter cube with the distal water. The resulting solution is 0 0.01 molar KMnO4. After the observation and calculation, I am going to share with you some short questions and answers relating to this redox titration. First of all, the question is what is a redox titration? It is that titration in which the oxidizing agent is titrated against reducing agent vice versa. What is oxidizing agent? A substance that gains electron during chemical reaction is called oxidizing agent. For example, KMnO4, K2Cr2O7, concentrated HNO3, H2O2, yani hydrogen peroxide, what is reducing agent? A substance that loses electron during chemical reaction is called reducing agent. For example, FeSO4.7 H2O and oxalic acid COOH twice 0.2 H2O. Oxalic acid, it is also the example of reducing agent. More definitions or more questions define oxidation and reduction. A process in which there is a loss of electrons is called oxidation and a process in which there is a gain of electron is called reduction. Another question, what is a oxidant and re reducent? Oxidant is a substance that gain electrons. Reducent is a substance that gives electrons. Another question. Is heating is necessary for titration of KMnO4 with FeSO4? No, because on heating, ferrous sulfate is oxidized to ferric sulfate. At the end, two more questions are here. Give three reasons responsible for the formation of brown precipitate in KMnO4 titration. 1. The solution may be cold. 2. The quantity of dilute sulfuric acid added may be insufficient. 3. KMnO4 might have been added in large amount and too quickly. Why dilute sulfuric acid is added in KMnO4 titration? It is redox titration. KMnO4 is an oxidizing agent and can be titrated against a reducing agent like FeSO4. The redox reaction takes place in the presence of dilute sulfuric acid. See you next for video lecture for this same experiment. Subscribe and keep watching Amjad Ali Ali1522 at youtube.com take care of you and all around of you especially your parents okay allah peace